a, a very good afternoon Dutch bike blogger. Thank you for riding with me. And I'm on my way to the Media Markt where I bought my Nikkei Extreme X6 action camera. And yesterday I tried to use it and unfortunately it died on me. First of all I, when I switched it on I had some trouble switching it on, it took a while. Then it switched on, made some sun funny noises. Then the back screen froze. And then it switched on again, I thought it was working. Distorted image. Pixelated image on the back of the screen. And then I finally thought it was working. But yesterday when I came to my appointment in Leeuwenborg, I found out that the camera was switched off and it's not able to switch it on again. By the way, if you think, how the hell is he filming? Well, I'm using a normal in uh, SJ Cam SJ5000 X Elite, which works always. So I'm filming with that one. Actually, the Nikkei is now broken. I used for uh, video footage from backwards. I had it mounted under the saddle pin. Uh, many times not all the time but many times and that made videos from picture in picture like from filming with the SJ cam and then in the top left corner I was filming what was going on behind me Uh, to, to find to try to find some links top right corner that you can see what I'm uh, talking about well continue the camera story when I got home of when I when the camera was switched up when I arrived at the appointment I thought well maybe the battery died I just uh, recharged it a little bit before that and so I recharged it I got it once or twice working, aka it was switching on, keeping stuck at the intro screen which says in big letters Nikkei, and that was it. I switched out the battery, I came to notice that the battery in the Nikkei X Dream X6 is the same one which is in the in the SJ cam, that's a lucky coincidence. On the hand it's probably a standardized battery. Well that did not work either and now I'm stuck with a dead camera. And that's why I'm going to MediaMarkt to ask them what they I'm going to do about this. On the website I saw twee jaar fabrieksgarantie. So oh, that's warranty as of factory. Factory warranty. Well, I do have to say the camera is almost two years old. Bought it two years ago in 2018 at May 6th and it's now April 29th
but yesterday due to the rain I did not go to the media mart again or right away I have to say so that's what I'm doing now probably gonna have a nice discussion about what the lifespan technical lifespan of the camera should be and whatnot we'll have to ask and see and on the bike ride back to home I will inform you don't know if that's going to be one video or separate videos but I have to see about that depends on how long it's going to be let's wait for traffic it's quite busy with traffic I'm surprised actually Wednesday by the way now that it matters let's have a look at the watch it's a little after 3.30 so 15 15.36 or so there's an obstruction on the bike lane let's move over behind this car Continue straight depending on the bus is going and the bus is going to turn in the car also so let's not do something dangerous and let's roll on going straight over to here Well, unfortunately, I cannot film in the store, so I have to shut you down. I will park my bike and go inside and have a look if somebody is willing to help me. And like I said, I will inform you when I get back. Hopefully the good news. Actually, not counting on it, but we'll have to see. First of all, let's try to park a bike somewhere. And as you can see, I'm back on my bike again. Let's walk a bit, because it's actually not allowed to drive the bike here, so let's take it easy and have a walk, especially when there is a car. Not sure what it is, but... Toezicht en handhaving. Boas, like a gewoon opsporingsambtenaar. Not the police, but they are allowed to pick to give you a ticket. Which I'm actually not wanting to risk. Come a little bit, maybe a little bit of noise, sorry for that. Well, returning home with good news. The camera is not going to be repaired. They took it in and gave me a refund.
so it's actually quite a good deal I paid 69 euros for it almost two years ago used it not very extensively but I did use it it's broken it will be sent back to the factory Nikkei in this case they will probably throw it away because they are not going to try to repair this no use for that I see maybe thought they would be giving me a new camera but a customer service employee said there was no new camera available and if so it was more expensive I saw the same camera on their website for 120 euros, 119 something. It's a lot more than I paid for it. So I don't have no extra camera anymore. And to be honest, lately I was not using it very much. It's a nice effect to have picture in picture and picture video from the back of the bike but it's kind of a hustle to edit it also you have double data from two cameras the one I'm filming with the Nikkei it takes up storage space all my videos on the hard disk actually back up so no more back cameras anymore at least not until I found out how to get new things now is the time not to buy a new camera I'm still looking for a job and it's all to do with income we have some social security here in Holland called WW Werkeloosheid with unemployment But that's a lot less than I used to make. First two months after you uh, apply for unemployment, you will get 75% of your last salary, your last paycheck, and then it will be 70. Well, that's quite a lot. By the way, other interesting thing, I did not get cash back. I get a refund on the bank card. I to put my bank card in the pin machine and they were run funding me on my bank account, 69 euros. I'm gonna assume it's on, but of course I will have to check when I'm home. By the way, I thought I filmed a little bit with the camera, the Nikkei, yesterday. There was also some video file on the SD card of 3 megabits, not gigabytes, uh, very small. But it's unreadable. 
so the recording was not done properly also so probably a total fail and normally the camera I was not using lately I did keep the battery updated by the way or charged every two weeks or so and I'm actually very lucky that the thing died within the two years factory warranty Garanti, Fabrics Garanti and not after that otherwise it would have been a problem I think And uh, in the end I used the camera for two years on and off, actually for free. Only thing is the shop Media Mart made some interest probably on my 69 year old. When the money train arrives, we probably will have to see if we can get something else. But for now, it's actually okay. I'm actually almost home. Thank you for riding with me, hearing me talk and just telling you this story. Like the video, subscribe to the channel, check out the description box. I will see you next time. Like always, be safe out there.